look amazing, dude. Like, you look so good right now. I'm hyped. The tan looks amazing. You look amazing. Posing's looking good. Like, you're gonna crush it today, man. I'm hyped to watch it. Let's go. What's going on? Yeah. Yeah? You excited about it? Yeah. And nervous? I'm not nervous. But excited. But you know, like, you had to flex in front of, like, a lot of people. Yeah. You know what I mean? Things you never done before. Well, yeah. I, mean, was, yeah, they, I just want you to kind of kick back and relax. Yeah. Um, you're probably gonna be pretty tired. Yeah. And uh, we'll get some food in you in between. Yep. Number eight, Jason. Number ten, Joshua. Number eleven, Ashley. Game day. It's six forty seven in the morning. I'll be there around nine. Twenty weeks of prep is done, all the work is done. Now it's time to hit the stage today in a few hours. I'm super excited. Super happy about the look and I weigh two or three point eight this morning. So, yeah, now it's time to uh, put those poses on stage. Yeah, it's been a hell of a journey, not just the past 20 weeks, it's been almost three years of consistency, hard work, and not giving up, and sticking to the diet, and uh, it's time to uh, show what uh, I have achieved on summer shredding stage. I'm so hyped right now. Look at this jacked. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes, sir. Game day. Okay, I'm gonna call my uh, pausing coach now. What's up, bro? What's up? How are you doing? No, good man. How are you doing? <laughs> good, good. That was my dad. Dude, looking great, bro. Thank looking you. good. Thank you. Dude, I'm hyped. <laughs> hyped. Let's Me go. Too. Yeah. Yeah, remember now, try not to have your hands come around to the front of you. Try to keep them on your side so your knuckles are really rolling into your hip. Yeah, good. And then remember, we want to get those chests and shoulders up big. And then, yeah, lean forward a little tiny bit. There we go. Elbows forward. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah. Now, so ready? Right into the lat spread. Three, two, one, lat spread. Boom. Three, two, one, front double bicep. Boom. Three, two, one, side chest. Boom. Three, two, one, side tricep. Boom. And then rotate to the back. And back double bicep. Three, two, one, boom. And back lat spread. Three, two, one, boom. And then rotate most muscular. Three, two, one, higher on the legs. Boom. Good. No, so like cross it over. Yeah. So like cross, yeah, and now spin on your feet. Spin, boom. That looks a lot cleaner. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's so gonna be a little bit faster to transition as well, but it just looks like it's like a little more classy uh, to like put your foot behind and then spin. If that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. But yeah, man. All in all, dude, you're all looking right. fantastic. Thank you. Like you look amazing, dude. Like you look so good right now. I'm hyped. The tan looks amazing. You look amazing. Posing's looking good. Like you're gonna crush it today, man. I'm hyped to watch it. Thank you, thank you. 
All right. All well, right. you have a good show day morning. Make sure you take some time to relax, chill out, and, you know, this is going to be gone in a blink of an eye. So make sure you just really <laughs> appreciate the present moment because I remember how fast everything happened. Yeah. But you worked so hard for this day, man, so appreciate and cherish every, every second of it. All right. Thank you. Here we go, baby. Let's go. What's going on? Yeah. Yeah? You excited about it? Yep. And nervous? I'm not nervous, but excited. Well, you know, like you had to flex in front of like a lot of people. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Things you never done before. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a one hell of a day. Yeah. Excited. You're going to make history. First Sri Lankan to do this shit. Yeah. First male Sri Lankan to do this. So, yeah. you know, what? you go there, out there, you do uh, what you got to do. Yeah. All right. Okay. I'll see you there. All right. Yes, sir. Let's go. Game day, first meal of the day. Of the game day. 300 grams rice, 80 grams ground beef, and 20 grams of peanut butter to carb up, and some salt. And I'm getting uh, little sips of water. This is the uh, game plan from Ryan. Yeah. Wait. I forgot to heat the meal. Everything's ready. Bit of bird. A bit of number. After the show, tea, ice cakes before the stage. It's super surprising. I'm gonna have one of these before hitting the stage. That's a cover. Honey is there. Get ready. That's it for the bag. Bags ready. Alright, let's go to the venue. Um, yep. Good. And then, oh yeah, Eddie. Eddie. All right, that's it. Post show. Standing's done, and uh, I'm here waiting now, just chilling. Um, so, getting huge support from everyone. I love you all, getting messages and everything. I love, I love all your support, and I appreciate it. Uh, it's time to go on stage and pose and have fun. Hi, Hello. say hi. Hey, how's it going? Good, good. So you're you're getting the tan now? Yeah. Hey. Looking jacked. <laughs> All right. That's Emily. So, yeah. Exciting times. Let's go. All right. What's up, Joe? Very good. Oh, yes, sir. Nice. I'm pumped up, man. Give me, give me a hey. Yes, sir. This guy lost the same. Same amount. 195. Cheers. Good work, man. Nice, nice, yes, nice. Yes, sir. It's so exciting, man. So pumped. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome day. Yes. What's your number? Nine. Nine? I'm eleven. There so you're go. going in before me, maybe. I think so. Yeah. I think I'm, I'm I think I'm first oh, on, okay. on our side. Alright. Yeah. Oh, I can't it's wait. gonna be I can't yeah. Wait. It's gonna be very exciting. Yeah. yeah. Alright. What's the backstage meal of the day? Are 
again now. So you got everything you need? Yeah, I just had my rice cakes and uh, Big Dog is here. The game day. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. The game day. Exciting stuff. Exciting yeah. stuff. Um, so, so you're on first, right? Um, or no, not. I seen the order. 11, I'm pretty, I, I thought you were on first. Uh, I'm like 11. 11? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's when it's supposed to start. It will take like an hour. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Um, so I have just had four rice cakes, peanut butter, and honey. Honey, yeah. yeah. And what time is it now? Quarter two, around 11. I would say, what kind of, did you get a chocolate bar? Yeah. What kind did you get? Kit Kat. Nice. nice. <laughs> um, I would say before you go out on stage, just yeah. like crush half the bar. Half the bar? Eat half the bar and uh, like have a couple of sips of Gatorade. Yeah. And then head out there. All right. That's nice. pretty much it. And then after the prejudging, then uh, after after the prejudging, I'm not sure how much time. Are you gonna stay here after prejudging? Like, till like four. Yeah. You're gonna stay here? Uh, I'm not sure. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's totally up to you what you do. Yeah. Um, I just want you to kind of kick back and relax. Yeah. Between. Um, you're probably gonna be pretty tired. Yeah. And uh, we'll get some food in you in between. Um, Maybe burger and fries. Yeah, in between. Before finals. Yeah. Um, so you can do that, and then depending on how you're, uh, how you're feeling and how you're looking, we might do another meal of. Uh, yeah, I brought like rice. yeah ground beef and rice. I yeah. brought it. Yeah. Yeah, you got some of those. So that's good. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, it's, it's totally up to you what you want to do. If you want to stay here yeah. and chill out and just you know eat, eat ground beef and rice, we can do yeah. like, two meals of ground beef and rice, um, or you know you can go get a burger and fries and yeah. crush that. And, Nice and full for finals, right? Yeah. So, tell me about you, man. All right. But, uh, yeah, what's the game plan? Yep. See. Cool. Cool. Exciting. Um, so just text me if you need anything backstage. Oh, okay. I'm like, I'm in the VIP seating, so I'm in like the first couple rows. Oh, okay. So nice. I'll be close so you can see me. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Good luck. So, yeah. How do you Thank you.
I was born and raised in Sri Lanka. I battled obesity since I was a kid. My parents owned a catering business. I was always surrounded by food and I didn't have any self-control. Back in 2020, I moved to Newfoundland, Canada to pursue my studies. And since then, I've been continuing my bad eating habits, binge eating and playing video games all day. I was at a rock bottom mentally and physically and I was weighing 400 pounds. I couldn't live like this any longer. It was a do or die situation for me. So I hired a trainer, I started eating healthier, I started making progress, and I fell in love with the process. Three years later, I'm grateful to be here, healthier, happier, and stronger than I have ever been in my life. It was the hardest thing I have ever done, living alone, away from my family, balancing my studies, and working at a fast food restaurant. After my graduation in 2023, I went back home to Sri Lanka to see my family. It had been almost four years since they seen me last, and they barely recognized me. proudest moment of my whole life. Three years ago, I could barely walk, but June this year, I was able to run a 10-mile road race in 99 minutes while doing this bodybuilding prep. If you want to change your life, no matter how crazy your goals might seem, just don't give up and be consistent.
I spin this wheel. Look at all the options he has. Let's see and it. look what I got. A freaking 20 push-ups on the show day. That's that's me.
like how many days? After five months. After five months? Woo! <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, I'm good for now. Nah, I have some. I have some. Here you go, here you go. Feels good. <laughs> Hashim. Oh, yay! Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Summer training show day was one of the best days of my life. The whole experience, the backstage, the stage routine, the stage lights, the posing and everything. That was one of the best experiences I ever had. Going into this prep back in March, I didn't have everything perfectly lined up to start this prep, but uh, I started anyway. I was kind of nervous. Going into this prep, I was like, would I able to like manage all the stuff, the training, the meal plan, because going through a, doing a prep needs a lot of effort. It's going to be a hectic 20 weeks, like low energy, low carb, dizzy, and but still you have to work 40 hours a week, do your, all the workouts, cardio, meal prep. So it was kind of nervous in the beginning, but I started anyway and I talked with Ryan. So he sent me all the uh, meal plans, training plan and everything. Then I started and since the week one, I was able to tick all the boxes every single day, like while balancing my work. And I was still able to like put on content on my all the channels and still able to meal prep, cardio training and everything. So I'm super happy about how all this went and also I was able to like run a road race eight weeks prior. That was another good experience while in a prep and uh, so the last eight weeks was very hectic just after the uh, road race. like. It was like, so my carbs got like cut down significantly in the last eight weeks and I was tired, dizzy all the time and I still had to work most of the days and uh, but I still managed to pull it off. I'm super happy and proud about what I did. So um, I would just want to conclude the video and I I really want to thank you all. My family wouldn't have been possible without them. My parents back home, yes, they gave me a huge support. And my brother, so this wouldn't have been possible without them. And all my friends in here in St. John's and my friends who helped me throughout this prep. You guys are amazing. And any of this wouldn't have been possible without uh, all of the support and uh, so this um this whole prep experience 20 weeks doing the same like eating the same meals every single day doing cardio training the very hectic repetitive 20 weeks and uh but it was a good experience i was able to like get shredded so and honestly i did it for the uh, experience i I uh, got the second place and uh, so um, I'm super happy about the results and everything and uh, I just wanted to do a bodybuilding competition and I uh, did it. So huge thanks to all of you and uh, I'm so grateful to have you all in my life and uh, yeah and uh, especially huge thanks to Summer Shredding for having this transformation category that we can go there, make a video, tell our story and then come on stage and do our posing with blue skin and everything. So um, I want to thank Summer Shredding for 
giving me this opportunity to share my story to the world and uh, giving us like, ex hobbies people to experience a bodybuilding competition prep and show their experience and everything I'm, I'm so I'm appreciating Christian Guzman and the whole summer training uh, community for this opportunity thank you very much and uh, so what's next for me so I'm qualified for the uh, final show in Houston so I'm not doing it this year so I'm also qualified for the next year so I can either do this year's or next year's I would probably do the next year's show uh, we'll see it's in November 2025 most probably so I'm aiming for that but to do that I gotta acquire a visa for US it's a long process we'll see what uh, gonna happen next so until then I'm gonna maintain my physique and uh, help other people to lose weight I'm gonna share my stories I'll share my routine and everything I'm gonna help um, other people to achieve their fitness goals that's my plan for the uh, next year all right thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I love you all.